this was a scene one Saturday morning last month when a Valdosta teen crashed her car trapped inside that smoking vehicle a Lowndes County teenager springing into action to save her. Now the two understandably great friends are Amber Spradley has more. It's a scene no mother wants to see. Lizzie Eldridge's mother taking this video of her daughter's car crashed into a bush, smoke and flames pouring through the door. I unbuckled my seatbelt and tried to open my door, but I could not get out and I couldn't go through the passenger side because it was shattered. The Valdosta High School senior saying she was driving to work one Saturday morning last month when her power steering stalled. Close by, Brock Bailey and his friend Bo Yeomans working on a shed. They heard the crash and came running. The two removing Lizzie from the SUV moments before it caught fire. It was a scary feeling. There was a, definitely a lot of adrenaline there. A um, little bit of panic, but uh, once she was out and safe, this is a good feeling. On Monday, the Lowndes County Board of Education presenting Brock with this Hero of the Heart Award. It seems like everything's going downhill, but you know, there are still positive things in this world, and I think that's what the award really showcases. Like, that's not how you want to meet someone, but I'm glad. The incident taking the two from strangers to close companions. I'm really lucky to have someone like that that's a part of my life now, like a huge part of my life now because, I mean, he saved my life. Lizzie's mom, Joy, says Brock stayed with her the entire time, providing comfort in a frantic moment. I think that Brock um, will be connected to us in a very special way for a long time. A bond built by bravery. In Valdosta, Amber Spradley, WCTV Eyewitness News. Okay, I mean, an unbelievable story, right? But how far will that friendship go? Hmm. Well, Lizzie's a Valdosta Wildcat. Brock is a Lowndes Viking, okay? Rivalry weeks, <laughs> October 9th. Well, that's the week that the two teams play. Uh -huh. uh, they say they're putting their friendship on pause uh, just for that week. <laughs>